I'm up closing on that. And the frames behind me, we uh, had a very propolis productive hive that was attacked by wax moths. In just a matter of a month, they were gone. But because of their absence, we need to clean these frames. And from it, all of this propolis. I'm closing on you right now. Just on that hive tool and what you're scraping at. And we've got a cleaned out hive, ready for new frames. Or ready for clean frames and a new colony. Here we have the final product drying out on a towel. I just took out this. This is from the tall pot after we poured out the initial amount through the strainer. So this was what was left over. It's a very thin sheet. So that shows that most of it is strained out. But this is a quarter inch and it has some weight to it. So it was worth the extra two hours in the oven. This is about a half an inch to an inch. Let's see. Okay, so here's what we got. We got a pound and three quarters of beeswax and we got 14 ounces of propolis and these two things are as raw as you can get it strained but not yet filtered for all the little little bits and like I said I could just scrape these off the top because these are superficial to the beeswax and that was the part that went through the second time around and this was the easy quick filter the first time and on the back you can see how dark it looks and that all is pieces and gray wax that is just a superficial color. That also gets scraped off. And if I slice it into strips, I can scrape it off really easy with a potato peeler. Well, here I am with the chamomile and I've soaked it and I've rinsed it. I'm separating it and putting it bit by bit into the juicer where I'm getting a nice green juice from the leaves. So I started off with this much chamomile, and I'm going to get about a quart of juice from it at the most. And I'll have all of these leaves and flowers for tea later. Now I'm melting the propolis, honey, and beeswax. The propolis and honey don't blend. But once it gets in with the beeswax, the beeswax will mix with the propolis and honey, like an emulsifier. It's getting a little more emulsified together. And you can see little bits from inside the propolis coming out that we will filter.